Guys, I'm your boy Mega back with another video, and today I'm gonna watch Hisoka to catch a predator. So this video is gonna be Hisoka and probably all his sus moments in Hunter x Hunter. If y'all know, first of all, what? How do y'all call it? Hunter x Hunter or Hunter x Hunter? I'm gonna just call it Hunter x Hunter. Hisoka was like mad weird. I just remember the one scene where he had like a, I don't know, it was like a gumball or something in his in his tongue, and he was just flicking that bit. I'm not gonna do it, cause like nah, that shit was weird. And then how he was looking at um that one scene where he was looking at Gone and um Killua, I was like, bro, what the hell? He's definitely he definitely weird, bro. And I don't know if the that's the vibe they're trying to go for. It obviously was because you know the hell he he didn't need to do all that shit, bro. His ass was weird. But before I get into the video, make sure you guys like and subscribe. Don't forget to let me know what you want me to what you want me to react to next in the comments down below. Without further ado, I'm gonna get into the video. I can't take it anymore. Hi, this is Sitting here fantasizing by laying you on your stomach and tuning that big old red ass up and spreading and folding the big old red ass. Come on, who's on the phone? And now I'm digging that pussy to the squirting and far and squirting and far and squirting and far. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. What is this audio? <laughs> like, what is that? Is that like a real life audio? Was a nigga actually saying that? Hey. Mmm. 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 I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, bro. After this shit this nigga's done, if this man is allowed to roam the streets freely, free R. Kelly. Hisoka is a literal super villain. Look what he did to this innocent man in the Hunter exams, bro. Dude accidentally bumped into him five seconds later. Hocus pocus, nigga. This man's arms are literally disintegrating. <laughs> that nigga started evaporating, bro. This nigga's hairline is demonically receding, but that don't mean you gotta reverse Joe Swanson, this nigga. Plus, this dude is zesty as hell. Look at how he just struts off like nothing just happened. His fit cold as hell, though, no cap. Anyways, later on, they run through the jungle, and these three niggas, Allah fellow Allah. members of the despicable the video spy, y'all. are plotting on jumping Hisoka to try and get back for the lost soldier. So they catch this man on his ones in the woods. This bald ass nigga got a stick. I don't know what he thinks he's cooking. And then the leader is like, <laughs> you my niggas, you don't quite appreciate how clean your hairline is. One bit, Hisoka. Yeah, not one bit. <laughs> Do you guys really think I give a fuck about the madness your barber did to your head? <laughs> I'm only here to find those two little kids. Uh, take his hairline! Oh wait, hold on. Y'all not getting my hairline either way. He packed every last one of them up with a four. Got this grown ass <laughs> man on his knees crying out for help. Then this dude just throws a card into the back of this nigga's head and sends him to the afterlife. The yeah, them cards is like knives, bro. I remember. Stumble upon this murder scene and his soak zesty ass is like, oh, do y'all boys want to play too? They're not trying to get their cheeks taken today, so they book it. But hold on, this nigga L'Oreal's back. I can't do it. I can't run away. As a fellow fucked up hairline brother, I will let you get away with this. Hisoka hit this nigga with a substitution jutsu and immediately went for this man's booty hole. Leorio's about to get violent. But our dog gun <laughs> hit him in the face with his to catch a predator fishing rod. You can tell this man Hisoka was excited. Shit up forgot about Leorio and started trying to riz up Gon. But the second he turned away, Leorio got up and tried to sneak him. But bro, someone please stop this man from cooking. Had this man doing several minutes. Nah, this nigga would definitely be like a scary ass nigga in real life. So Gon tries to jump in and swing. With that damn this fishing man isn't rod. even interested in fighting Gon. He just wants to whisper and riz into his ears. Does your booty hole taste like banana pudding? Ah. I'll take that as a guess. <laughs> Soka is just walking towards him, weaving all his attacks and getting hard. So Gon tries to distract him with some dirt and an attack from behind. But bro just grabs him by the neck. Look at how he's grinning. I don't want to know what kind of that freaky ass scary, bro. he's thinking about. He lets him go. Promises Gon there's going to be some delicious candy in his van. Grabs Lurio and walks off. Fast Did he actually say that? There's going to be candy in the van? Because what the hell? That's weird. Matches. Whoever was in charge of this shit is a dickhead. He sent a child to hunt Hisoka. Oh, damn well he's on EDP timing. So anyway, Gon starts training so he can finesse Hisoka's badge from him without actually having to box. Pussy. And he finds him just absolutely <laughs> vibing under a tree. But the jit is shivering his timbers. To be honest, I don't blame him, bro. Hisoka's creepy as hell. So Gon's waiting in that bush for hours. And Hisoka finally gets up and is like, you know I can see you. Those cheeks will be mine, nigga. Come out. You'd think he's going for Gon, but then an absolute random pops out of a bush and squares up. I have no idea why this man wanted smoke with the anal assassin. But Hisoka's just weaving everything. Yeah, that man Hisoka was different. And 
begging him to kill him. He's trying to go out like a real nigga, but Hisoka's just not interested in anyone over 14. Fast forward again, and after Hisoka hits a lick on Leorio and Kurapika, he starts to get horny. It's been days since he's taken some cheeks, and he's fiending. I've never seen a man get so horny, his whole demeanor changed. Do y'all think he got a boner right now? Hisoka sees some random nigga minding his business. It's been such a long time since I've seen Hunter Hunter. I didn't even man. know he was oh on God, this type this of timing face. like that. I almost don't want to see what he does to him. Right before Hisoka murders this man, Face Gun hits the craziest snipe of his career and yoinks Hisoka's back. This man, Hisoka, is ecstatic. He looks like he damn near nutted when he saw Gon hit that. Lil Bro starts running all excited and shit, but then another sniper hits him with a tranquilizer. Man, why you gotta kill Lil Bro's whole moment like that? Hisoka murders this nigga, but shit, it's just him and Gon. And that little nigga's paralyzed. I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline NBC. Yeah, fuck that I'm out. After the hunter exam, oh, he didn't do nothing. Yeah, that's a good thing. Arena, trying to squabble. I was getting scared After for a second. <laughs> several niggas, they head to the next level, but they get greeted by some diabolically horny energy. Who could it belong to? Who else but Quagmire? It's Quagmire. Quagmire. Now I'm just playing. It was Ahsoka. Kilo asks him why he's here, and Ahsoka hits him with a light skin stare and is like, "It's not that strange." I like taking butts, and there's butt here to be taken. I'm lying. I've actually been stalking you, waiting for you to get off your plane. Joseph can have the opportunity to be the one who snatches your cheeks. I gotta rewatch this. Right. I gotta know if this nigga's really on that type of time. Anyway, so because if he was, that's train, weird. Come back and just absolutely eat through Hisoka's barrier. Gon challenges him to a fight to once and for all end Hisoka's predatory behavior, and Hisoka accepts. The battle is about to begin. The anal assassin versus his innocent victim. Shit's looking serious. Who will win? Did this nigga just moan? Oh no, nah, this nigga's hard! Man, get his ass gone! <laughs> I remember that scene. Oh, oh, oh. Me, I remember me, 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 that me, me, me. scene. Oh, yo! Ah. Damn, what a zesty ass kick! Gon keeps trying. He sprints and looking for the perfect opportunity. He jumps, gets weaved, and Yeah, his nigga Hosoka was different. It's not looking good. He can't even get a hit, and Hisoka's just seductively staring him down. It is dead silent. The battle is nothing but straight hands. Just one, two, ba, one, two, ba, two, ba, two, ba, Hey, I'll pray for God, man. He's not dead, but I saw his booty about to be burning after this. Hisoka's trying to beat him without even moving an inch, but God's determined to outmaneuver him. Little nigga jumps at him, starts throwing out all these shadow clones, then goes and picks up a boulder, fucking obliterates it. Had this man chopping blocks like he was this man the gone. Then slowly creeps up behind him, and then sneaks this nigga dead in the face. Gun is that nigga for real? Isola starts gathering up all his R. Kelly spiritual pressure and elbows the little dude. Then he literally just runs up behind him and volleys him like a volleyball. I kid you not, he then tries to kick him and Falcon kicks the floor into the goddamn stand. Why do people in anime watch these fights, bro? That block could have killed like 30 niggas. So Isoka starts chasing his 30, 30 kind of gas him, but he definitely would have killed some niggas. Gone and took him to his white van. <laughs> now nah, I'm playing. He starts pulling him around with bungee gum. I can't lie, I thought bro was about to kiss him, but nah, he hits him with a mean right. I'm surprised they let this fight continue, bro. Gon is getting violated. Had little bro looking like he just fell down the stairs in Family Guy. Gon's not giving <laughs> up and he jumps at Ahsoka again. But bro, Ahsoka is so fucking horrible. What? He's absolutely tweaking right now. He is letting this little man wail on him to fuel his pain kink. Gon can't even do anything though. He getting pulled into all of his punches. The ref makes a bullshit right, yeah, I remember call he had that little, like, that little bungee oh, joint. On your right. That bungee huh? shit. Oh, my fault. I meant your left. And then Gon loses by TKO. He got hold, bro. He could've won that. He, he could've won that. Nah, he could. All right, now we in Greed Island. This arc was so mid. The dodgeball game at the end carried, but let's get straight into it. Gon and Killer looking for some sick dodgeball players, so they fast travel to what they thought was Crollo. Oh, yeah, this is the video game arc. And oh, no, I know. I kind of liked it. It hasn't even been five seconds. This nigga's already it was all right, kinky again. But definitely from and like... Is out. But definitely definitely the other arcs in this joint. Um, The one after the, the ants in the... The one with the I forget I forget what was that uh, the sh the Phantom Troop, definitely like this wasn't even a bad arc. Those, those two arcs were just great. Those were like great arcs. Stop playing. Anyway, so they recruit them and they start heading to their match. Yo, what is this nigga doing, bro? He's just like me for real. All right, so they gotta play dog. Just like you for real. Unit and it's seven. What do you NPCs. mean by that? All the extra niggas they got are pussy as hell and they're about to dip out. I don't know why they're so scared, bro. All he did was pop some nigga's head. They ain't need him anyway. He replaced him with some gorillas. Damn, I barely by remember. Way, would be a I remember. Fight. They start with the ball, and I'll just call this nigga Jamal. Jamal gets a Jamal. few minutes in, taking out the fodder <laughs> trash, but when he throws it at the buff nigga, he catches it with one hand. Oh, nah. Everybody duck. Nigga, what did you do and move? I'm dead. 
You know how in anime they just be looking. And he saves himself from absolute annihilation. They start passing the rock around and Mach 10 and just destroy all sliver. They are taking these niggas out one by one. But they got the Adel assassin on deck. They not out just yet. His uncle starts taking them out with his bungee gun. But then these two Bungie niggas merge into gun. one and catch the ball. So this nigga literally bowls the ball and it's headed straight for Killua. Psych, it's headed straight for Hisoka, but he weaves it. Then this nigga just comes out of nowhere and whips it straight at Hisoka's face. Hisoka catches it like a sexy ass he is, but god damn, he broke two fingers. Gon's had enough of this shit, so he punches the ball straight into Fat Joe and sends him tumbling out of the court. That's one, now Gon has to go for the big dog. He runs it back, but this man bumps it into the sky and does a backflip. Hisoka yoinks it back before he can catch it, but nigga, what is this guy made out of? He throws it up and hits the most demonic spike ever seen, but these niggas are ready. They dead ass catch it. With the power of friendship, it's the final punch. The power of friendship. All into it, nigga said. Jai it really be like that in anime. Jun, my friends, Ken. they're all counting on me. <laughs> that shit was powerful as fuck. We don't even talk about Hisoka no more, bro. This is crazy. Big Dog pumps it back, but Gon passes out. But Hisoka, the real nigga, knows this is not how Gon wants to win, so he sends it back. This time with nut on it, and it's stuck. They send him out the court and win. But what a sexy victory and a sexy end to this video, man. Don't leave, though. Y'all need to go join up the Discord in the description, like, right now. Y'all get to put your input on the vids. I post videos of me twerking occasionally. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about the Discord, <laughs> but um, yeah, that was definitely a funny video. Shout out to Ola Wulo for this. Ola Wulo, he might be Nigerian that name, but uh, that's what I was pointing. That was definitely a, a funny. I don't know, funny, cause it was funny, but kind of alarming too because Isoka was definitely on a different timing. I didn't know he was literally on this timing like that, cause I've seen Hunter Hunter, but it's been a minute, and I knew his ass was weird. I didn't know his ass was weird. This like on this type of level though. I'm gonna have to rewatch it to see because it's been a minute since I've seen it. I gotta, I gotta see if niggas are really on that type of timing, bro. This, but this was a great edit, a great anime. I recommend all y'all niggas go watch this shit. This shit was perfect. This shit was fire, flames. I don't know when the hell's gonna come come back. I heard they're um, they're continuing the um uh, the the manga. The nigga who wrote the manga, like he's he's back on it. So it might be animated soon soon. I don't know. It might just be animated in general because that's what that's what just niggas want. Cause it's been, this was like 2011, 2012. We in, bro, right now, like, bro, we in like 2022, 2023, bro. Come on now. Come on now. We in, well, 2023 when I put out this video. But come on now. But anywho, that was a funny video. Let me know what you guys thought about it in the comments down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one. All right. Peace.